Hello friends, this is Ryan Hicks of TaughtToProfit.com. Today I want to talk to you about is doing what you love the thing you have to do in order to make money and success and build a business. And the reality is that is an old saying. You hear people everywhere say it, but is it really true? And I'm going to tell you, for most of you, if you examine your life and the things that you love, those things are not going to bring you a lot of money. They're not going to bring you large business and success. They just simply won't. But where is this idea that you have to love what you're doing? I'm not saying you have to hate it. If it's something you hate and you you have to drag yourself to do it and it's just miserable, you're not going to do it. You won't be successful with that because it just won't be something you will continue and make a success. But it could be something that is not too bad. Maybe it's not something you love, but you like it and you enjoy it some of the time. Maybe other times it's not enjoyable, but it's not a miserable thing. It's not something that you dread doing. There may be days you don't want to do it, but it's definitely not something you love. You wouldn't do it for free if if there was no pay involved, but it's not something you hate either. This idea that you're going to do what you love and make a bunch of money. People make money doing things they don't necessarily love, but they also don't hate. And to think that you're going to something you love, okay, you love jogging. How are you going to make millions of dollars doing that? How are you going to become successful and grow your business running? Now, there's all kinds of things you could do in the running field from designing shoes to devices that monitor all kinds of things you could do but the reality is for most people they are not going to be able to do what they love and make a large sustainable income that can be used to bless other people bless their own families and be a benefit to the world it's just not going to happen and this is one of the things that hinders many people because they hear this do what you love and they try to do what they love they try to turn it into some sort of business and it fails miserably And they just give up and say, well, I forget it. I can't do this. It's not true. Find something that you're good at. Not necessarily something you love. But it can't be something that makes you miserable. It can't be something that you don't like at all. But there can be something that it's all right. You like it. But it's not necessarily the favorite thing you've ever done your entire life. But if you can find something that you're actually good at that you have a skill set for or can build a skill set for, that's where you're going to find success. And you'll find out too, as you get better and as you build the business and grow, you're going to enjoy it a lot more too. Sometimes people don't like something because they're not good at it. And they do love something that they're good at, but that doesn't necessarily translate into a viable business. Many times people, when they're getting started, They don't necessarily love what they're doing, but they grow into it and it becomes something they actually love. We see this with all kinds of individuals that are currently telling people, do what you love, just do what you love, find your bliss, all this nonsense. The reality is, if you find something that you can do and you can do well, or at least have the ability to do well, maybe you can grow into it and you don't dislike it, as long as you like it, doesn't mean everything about it's perfect and great, but as long as you like it, you will find as you build upon success and success and success, that will be something that can grow into something you love. But don't misunderstand this loving what you're doing with the idea of every second of the day, everything you're doing in the business is just great and cheerful and wonderful. You'll have problems. There's problems with any business. If you have any kind of success, you're going to have things that are going to come your way that are not going to be pleasant necessarily. But the overall thing will be that you like what you're doing and it can grow into something that you actually love. And even if it doesn't, you can still find great success. And that thing that you you like doing, but not necessarily something you love, but you build it into a successful business, that will give you more freedom to do the things that you do love. Many people can never do the things they love 
and they hate their jobs or their businesses and they're just miserable all around. You can enjoy what you're doing or at least like it and then use it to do those activities, those things you want to do that you actually love doing. So you have to get out of this mindset that you got to do what you love. Find something that you're good at that you can do that is not miserable. It's not work that is just taxing on your system that you can't possibly have any enjoyment in. Move into that. Go 100% at it and you'll become successful. And it might actually become something you love because as you grow in it, as you become more successful and get better at it, you may actually start loving it. And it may be something you really thrive off of. You didn't realize you were going to because you were looking at these things that you do that you love, but there's no viable business in those things. So my friends, don't get confused. Find something that you could at least like, that you have some aptitude towards, and go 100% into that, and you will find success. May God bless you richly.